All right, so we all know that Novak Djokovic has parted ways with Goran Ivanisevic, right? So he's parted ways after, I think, like five years, six years, something like that. And we're all thinking, who's going to step in and be the coach of Djokovic, right? Who's going to step in to his place? And I've got some theories, chat. And it starts with Holger Runa. So if you don't remember, about a month ago, Holger, or two months ago, Holger Runa hired Boris Becker. He hired him, and then after like a couple of days or a couple of weeks, they parted ways. Boris Becker he, on Twitter in February, the start of February said, uh, I would like to inform you that I will step down as head coach of Holger Runa with immediate effect. And they broke up or they they split. So Boris Becker is not coaching anybody. And Boris Becker, he coached Djokovic to six Grand Slams, the three years they were together. But most importantly, Novak Djokovic won his first French Open with Boris Becker as the coach. And that matters to this gold medal goal. But the second part of my theory is Marion Vida. Marion Vida is free. He is available. Now, he split with Djokovic at 2022. Marion Vida stepped away. But Marion Vida did not step away from coaching. He went to Molchan and started coaching him. They split in September. So Molchan over on Instagram said this back in September. He said, I would like to thank Coach Vida for all the experience he has given me and the whole team during the period of our cooperation. You are an outstanding person, great personality, and you deserve nothing but the best in the future. Thank you for everything. So Molchan and Vida have split after two years of working together. So Marion Vida's free. Now, why is that a big deal? Well, it's a big deal because Marion Vida, of course, coached Djokovic pretty much his entire career to great success. He coached him to two French Opens. He coached him to nine Australian Opens. He coached him to six Wimbledons, three US Opens. But more importantly, he coached him to a bronze medal at the Olympics back in 2008. The only medal that Djokovic has got is that 2008 bronze medal from uh, Beijing back in 2008. And that's a big deal. Now, let me just go through one more thing before we wrap this theory up. 2014, Boris Becker comes on as coach with Djokovic. Marion Vida was still around. The dream team. Some would say some of the best years of Djokovic's career. 2014, he goes 14-2 and two on clay. He wins Rome. He makes the final of Roland Garros. He loses a Rafa in four, but everyone did. And he also lost to Federer on clay that year. So he had 14 wins, two losses with Boris and Marion Vida as the, as the dream team. 2015, he goes 16 wins, one loss. He wins Monte Carlo, he wins Rome, he beats Nadal, he beats Federer, he beats all the guys, and unfortunately lost to stand in that final. So 2015 clay season with Boris and Marion Vida was one of the best he's ever had. And then 2016, same team, he loses first round Monte Carlo, we don't talk about that. He wins Madrid, he makes the final of uh, Rome, loses to Murray, and then he finally wins that French Open. The first ever French Open win for Novak Djokovic, again, with Marion Vida and Boris Becker. So you get Bar you get Vida, you get Boris, and you might even get that gold medal. He's bringing back the Avengers. The band's back together. They're going for gold. He might even skip Wimbledon. Now, that's a wild theory, I know. We're not going to take it that far that he's going to skip Wimbledon because I think Marion Vida, if he's back, he might go, hey, look, you've won Wimbledon. We haven't got a gold medal. Let's let's ditch Wimbledon. We'll win it next year. That's a whole nother level. If that happens, then, you know, Call me Nostradamus. I reckon he's going to get Vida back, and I reckon he might even give Boris Becker a call and see if he's free. That's my theory, and it might even happen over the next week because the clay court season starts pretty soon. That's what I think is going to happen. Let me see what happens, uh, and if it doesn't happen, then you can all have a laugh.